Okay, let's try this again, shall we? Apparently, I tried recording this video just a bit ago and apparently my capture card window was frozen so it actually didn't record anything even though the recording time went up. The screen just stayed frozen and yeah, the recording was corrupted apparently because yeah, stupid. Okay, so hello everybody, welcome back to some more Mario Party minigames. We are going to be doing 1 vs 3 minigames in this one. I, over the past couple days, I've been trying to win more coins in minigame stadium by doing a little trick called putting everyone to hard computer player until the last turn, which is 30, because you want to do the max number of turns, 30. And then on the last turn, you make everyone human players, and that way, after the game ends, you'll get all coins from all players. So, that's how you can collect a lot of coins pretty quickly, because a lot of these minigames cost a lot to buy in the minigame house. Alright, I'm gonna do this, let's go with Tug of War. Oh, Okay, these guys are on very hard difficulty. And I just played through these like a bit ago, even though my capture window was being stupid and froze and corrupted the recording. So, it's actually not that hard for very hard uh, difficulty. So, there we go. Alright, so yeah. It's a, uh, it's a 3 versus 1 tug of war against the player in the Bowser suit. Rotate the control to pull the rope. Rotate to pull the rope. Just rotate your thing. When you fall from the cliff, you get eaten by a giant piranha plant, as you can see right there. And yes, how I rotate the control stick, I don't do this. I do this. Whoa, 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 whoa. You guys are not pulling me in and getting eaten. Get yourself, there you go. So, in the corrupted recording, I did it in five seconds because I just immediately went all in. But, as I was showing you here, it wasn't going fast enough, but there we go. Okay, so that's Tug of War. And next is one of the, one of the coin bonus minigames, Coin Sour Flower. Coins fall down in a sour on the flower. Everybody collect as many coins as you can get. It's gonna be a howler. Okay. <laughs> move and jump on the flower and then move your boat around on the water. The closer to the edge of the flower you get, the more it tilts. Don't get too greedy and fall in. Yes, sir. Okay. I don't know how many coins total come down onto the flower. Maybe 45, 50 coins, but... I don't think we'll ever get a whole lot. I don't think we'll ever get all of the coins. And I'm not doing a good job right now. Wow. I did wor I'm doing worse than my previous run through this. Wow. Whoa, come back here. Okay, doing a little better. Oh, come on. I have that. Finish. Okay. I'm guessing I got 35, maybe 36. I got 38 last time, so. I missed a few more that time. And yeah, oh, th oh, screw you. Wow. 30 is still a lot, so that's something. But uh, yeah, you're usually gonna be in the 30s. I have gone into the 40s before, but it depends on how quickly you get the coins because the, the flower tilts a lot and if you don't get the coins almost immediately, they're gonna go up, so. Bass and Cass, hit the player in the Bowser's suit with your hammer. The person in the Bowser's suit must run away until time is up. Move and jump and move and attack with the hammers. The player in the Bowser's suit can also grab the coins that get Bass out of them, so. Yeah, about that. You probably almost cannot do that. Get your coins back, because they almost get it immediately. 
And the way I try to do this, even though they keep doing that to me, poor Walt, get out of the... Come on! Get out of here! Come, come on! No! Stop it! Stop it! Get some help! You have no idea how much you're hurting poor Wario. Oh my god, these guys suck! Did I only lose 15? What the hell was up with Peachy's eyes? Nope, I lost the same that I did last time. Oh my god. 22? Oh my god. Wow. Yeah. It's almost really difficult to go through without losing a single money bag, but what can you do? Okay, tightrope treachery. The person on the tightrope must walk to the goal line. Players in both can, can suit their cannons with A. Move and move both in the suit cannon. You can also lose your balance, not only from cannonballs, but also from strong winds. Well, that's not gonna be a thing. I have beaten this quite well last time with 22 seconds left to go, but... Something tells me that this time it's not gonna be as easy. Come on, guys. Keep facing the other way. Don't, don't hurt poor Walt. Oh my god. Come on, let me go, let me go, let me go. Let me go, let me go, let me go, go, go. Oh my god, Peach. Stop being mean. Why is everyone so mean to Wall, yo? I don't get it. Cut. Stop falling down, Wall, yo. Seriously. I'm not gonna beat my time here. I will win, but... Oh my god. Stop it. Why do you want to murder this poor guy? What did Wario ever do to you guys? Oh my god. Get over the line. Let's go. There we go. Finish. Wow. <laughs> that was a little delayed. But damn. These guys suck. Wow. Alright, final minigame of this five minigame bunch, Piranha's Pursuit. Wow. Okay, press B repeatedly to escape the Piranha Plant. Players on the cloud hip-hop drop to feed the Piranha Plant with rain. Jump and skateboard, not run. Move and jump and hip drop onto the cloud with the other players. And as it rains on the piranha plant, it gets bigger and can jump farther. So, there we go. There we go. Alright. Okay. I do it this way. Turn the controller upside down. My mouse and finger on B. And the left thumb on A. So, it immediately jumps. Rather than the other finger trying to move to jump. And that is slower and can do you harm rather than help you avoid the piranha plant. Woo! There we go. Ho ho, look at me go! While you are flying. Oh, no, he didn't that time. Woo! You can try all you want, guys. You are not going to catch me. Wario is just too good of a skateboarder. And there we go. Finish. Okay, good. The recording is actually going smoothly for once. I can actually see it moving on the screen. There you go. One, 120 coins. Wow. Wario wins. Wario wins. And did not cheat in any way. So there we go. That's that. So there we go. Five minute games. One versus three. And let's do the other one. So let's do ball over first. <coughs> Coin game second. Paddle battle third. Pipe maze fourth. Where? Oh, here we go. Actually, 
Let's do coin block black coin block bath both and then bowl over laugh. There we go. Okay, uh, yeah, I will still be I could be the what, team of three but I want to be the solo player going through this, especially in Bowl Over and Pipe Maze. So yeah, let's go. Let's go bowling. The bowler uses to aim the shell while the people who are pins try to jump away. Move and aim the shell and throw with A, and they try to jump and move away from the Creeper Trooper shell. If the KT shell hits the edge of the lane, there's an electric shock and the game ends. Well, boo. Okay. I have gotten strikes before, but let's see if I can do that now. Probably not, but... Mm. Okay. Yoshi, get your butt butt over. There we go. Oh, I got... Don't move away. Come on. Yes. Yes. Ow. <laughs> Mario, you suck. You know that? Okay. I wanted to strike, but oh well. And apparently we start with five coins. Hmm. Okay. Next one up, we have Queen Gang. Maybe I should have put this last. Because when... Is Peach wearing shades? Huh. Okay. Either Peach guys turned into shades or they're looking weird. Okay, you are the Crane Game Crane. Try to grab the prizes by pressing A repeatedly. If caught, wiggle free with A. Move lower Crane and repeatedly grab. Wiggle to Try and get free. When you grab somebody, you steal one third of all their coins. That's the problem here, because two of them don't have any coins. Mario has five coins, so if I stole from him, I'll only get two coins. So, yeah. <laughs> so I'm actually going to just grab the chest, because that will contain ten coins. And it's right there. So you got the coin up there, which is one coin. The money bag, which is five. And then we have the chest here, which is ten. Oh boy. Come on, come on. Yeah, we got it. We're good. Finish. Wait, what? Did they have more co I didn't even, I didn't even notice that they, the coins increased. I, ah, right. but, but you know how it works anyway, so. If we stole from Mario or Yoshi, 50 coins, a third of 50 coins would be 16 coins. It's a third of 50. And if I stole from Peach, 45, it would be 15, so. There we go. I didn't actually lose that much. All right, paddle battle. Paddle your boat down the river with, oh yeah. The side guys hiding on the banks will poke you with spears. Poop, poop, poop. If you get too close, rotate the paddle. Rotate your thing quickly and completely. If the side guy's spear pokes you, you lose coins. Oh no. Well, I'm not gonna get hit once, so there we go. No 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 Oh yeah, take that. How does that feel? Oh my god, my finger is hurting right now. Ow. Ow. No, no, ow. Ah. 
Oh, great, now I got a blister. <laughs> It's not actually on the fingers themselves, cause the finger down here is actually hitting the control sticks. So I don't know if I can show you this, but don't worry, it's not the middle finger. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. I'll zoom in on it a bit, but yeah. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Screw these things. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know what gave them the idea that rotating the control stick, especially with the plastic one, is a, that good of an idea. And yeah, they had that uh, lawsuit with the palms getting blisters and bloody and all that crap, and they tried to move out gloves to the people that are using it and doing the thing, but apparently that wasn't working either, so they had to recall the gloves or something like that. I don't know. I never had that issue. Sometimes I wore... <laughs> sometimes I wore a batting glove because I played baseball growing up and I would sometimes wear a batting glove because that would definitely help. But yeah, oh my god. <laughs> okay. Coin block bass. Coin block bass. My god. Coins come out of these sturdy blocks when you break them. The person with the hammer can break them in one hit. Well, la -dee da Tell that to my finger, because it's broken. <laughs> Person with the hammer move, overhead swing, sideways swing, and they move and attack with, attacking the block with, oh, they just, they can attack the other players, and they can jump and hit the blocks. If you get attacked, you will drop your hammer. Anybody can grab the drop hammer. Well, that blows. Okay. Ow. Oh, one coin, how delightful. Oh, yeah. Get out of my way. 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 Ow! Oh, yeah, there we go. I got the coin black. I mean, bag. I mean, yeah. <laughs> wow. Okay, did I get more than them? Probably not. I did. Hallelujah. Mario only got one coin? Well, screw you. Oh, it actually worked out because Yoshi has 50... Th uh... I wanted pipe maze, not... Well, I have another chance for a strike here, but wow. I thought I picked Pipe Maze. Apparently, I didn't. <laughs> wow. We'll, we'll get Pipe Maze back after this, but... Um, Yoshi has 53 coins, Mario has 54, and Peach has 55. So, that kind of worked out, right? Yeah. Alright, here we go. My god. Ow. Okay, now we have the harder course, so at least that's something. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Whoa. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas. What? Finish. Yoshi didn't die. I hate that guy. Ah, well, that's fine. I won this one anyway, doesn't matter. Even if I lost 15 coins, I, it wouldn't have mattered. So there we go. All right, let's get back in and do the actual final mini game, which we can do that right there and go to Pipe Maze. Okay, there we go. I didn't, I don't know why that, okay. Here we go. All right. One of the harder minigames in Minigame Island because this is a little luck based. You might be able to tell which pipe will give you the treasure chest, but it's still a bit luck based because of how quickly the screen moves. So you don't really have that much time to focus on the pipes and see which ones go to where. Drop the treasure chest. 
into the pipe so it falls down to you. Move the chest with the control stick and drop it with A, A, A. And go with that. As the maze scrolls by, as the maze scrolls by, watch closely and wind your way to the top. Find the way to the top. There we go. Okay. I think one. Probably not, but oh my! I think I just did it. There we go. I win. Finish. Okay, that was an easy one. That was an easy one. Oh, yeah, they kind of gave gave me an easy one on that one, so. Yeah, about that. There's different pipe variations, so Mario I'll get, I'll play it one more time and we'll see how it does there. All right, give me a harder layout. So there are at least three different layouts. I don't know how many total there are, but I know there's three at least. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess and go with three. I don't know. I probably lost. Or maybe I didn't. I did. I lost. Or I didn't. Wow! I got lucky on that one. I got lucky. That was just a guess on there. Cause I thought it was either two or three. But I guessed right. So there we go. Ha ha ha. Mario, you suck. You don't get anything. Alright, there we go. Hope you guys enjoyed 1 vs 3. Sorry this took a few days to get out to you guys, but yeah, I was trying to get the rest of the minigames bought so I can actually do a lot of this for you guys. And yeah, apparently it took me a little while to do because I was busy with other things and also busy binge watching The Big Bang Theory. Cause yeah, I have the complete series, so I've been watching a lot of that, so yeah. So yeah, comment down below your experiences with rotating the control stick. I want to know if you guys use the palm or the fingers like I did. Or if you have a different way of doing it, let me know. Yeah, I got a little vista here, this stupid feature. Yeah. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time for the one player minigames. Later.